Hello and welcome to another review in the Tips and Text series by Scale Wall Machines. We've been sent this by Hysterex Agents. It's the first in a new series of soft cover books from Modeling Books Publishers. The title is Tank Modeler and the way it's written is because it's a reference to the publisher Murat Osgur. Murat, who's a very keen modeler and has practiced the hobby for many, many years, you can see one of his creations there, has collated together a series of models in this 88-page book. All of the modeling book series, and tank modeler series specifically, are part of the AFV Models in Scale. And this particular reference, the first, is all about 148 scale. The theme of these books is generally single models that would be displayed by themselves in any scale, but clearly this first release is based around 148th. The first thing that jumps out is the excellent page layout and quality. It is soft cover and the pages are silky on slightly thinner paper. Inside there's one, two, three, four, five, six, six different subjects all by different modelers, most of them very well known and names that you should recognize. Before we go through it in detail one of the striking features is the well laid out graphic design, the stunning photographic imagery and the time that's been lavished on creating this series. Let's have a look at what you get. And so in volume one we start off with a Tiger One early production and inside there'll be a little bit of history, generally a review of the kit and of course very beautifully shot step-by-step -step photos. It uses inlaid close-ups and the quality of the photography is really very impressive. On pages 20 to 21 the build of the Churchill Mark III of the King Force in the Western Desert by Domingo Hernandez begins. Again plenty of construction shots. Before we move to a Sturm Tiger by Sven Frisch this particular model has plenty of shots of how the armor texture was created in construction shots painting using AK Real colors. This is followed by a Stug 3 Aus B German assault gun with plenty of photographic details of how all the extras, aftermarket extras were added. And the painting process is explained in 43 steps. Then we've got an allied tank, M10 Achilles tank destroyer and plenty of shots of the painted model in the recognisable style of Luciano Rodriguez and also a fine modeler with a well recognised and beautiful style, Michael Rinaldi. We close with an SD KFZ 251-22 Packwagen with a gasoline conversion added to the Tamiya kit. Everything's explained in well written text, plenty of white space and it's all very professionally and very neatly laid out so it's easy to follow. Pages 86 to 87 closes this really nicely produced bookazine or book that's available from Hysterex Agents. There'll be more in the series so watch this space. Hopefully we'll review some more of them and you'll go out and add this to your collection. Very visual and very appealing indeed. Thanks for watching and bye.